List of Presidents of the Philippines Under the present Constitution of the Philippines, the President of the Philippines is both the head of state and the head of government, and serves as the Commander-in-Chief of the country's armed forces. The President is directly elected by qualified voters of the population to a six-year term and must be a natural-born citizen of the Philippines, a registered voter, able to read and write, at least 40 years of age on the day of the election, and a resident of the Philippines for at least 10 years immediately preceding such election. Any person who has served as president for more than six years is barred from running for the position again, upon an incumbent president's death, permanent disability, resignation, or removal from office, the vice president assumes the post, first president of the Philippines, Emilio Aguinaldo, in office, January 23, 1899, March 23, 1901, Emilio Aguinaldo y Fami, was a Filipino revolutionary, politician, and military leader who is officially recognized as the first and the youngest president of the Philippines, 1899 to 1901, and the first president of a constitutional republic in Asia, second president of the Philippines, Manuel L. Quezon, in office, November 15, 1935 to August 1, 1944, Manuel Luis Quezon y Molina, he was the first Filipino to head a government of the entire Philippines as opposed to the government of previous Philippine states, and is considered to have been the second president of the Philippines, after Emilio Aguinaldo, third president of the Philippines, Jose P. Laurel, in office, October 14, 1943, August 17, 1945, Jose Pasiano Laurel y Garcia was a Filipino politician and judge. He was the president of the Second Philippine Republic, a Japanese puppet state when occupied during World War II, from 1943 to 1945. Fourth President of the Philippines, Sergio Ismeña, in office, August 1, 1944 to May 28, 1946. Sergio Ismeña Sr. He was Vice President under Manuel L. Quezon. Upon Quezon's sudden death in 1944, Ismeña succeeded him at age 65, becoming the oldest person to assume the Philippine presidency until Rodrigo Duterte took office in 2016 at age 71. A founder of the Nationalist Party, Asmenya was also the first Visayan to become president, fifth president of the Philippines, Manuel A. Roas, in office, May 28, 1946 to April 15, 1948, Manuel Acuna Roas. He briefly served as the third and last president of the Commonwealth of the Philippines from May 28, 1946 to July 4, 1946 and then became the first president of the independent Third Philippine Republic after the United States ceded its sovereignty over the Philippines. Sixth president of the Philippines, Elpidio R. Quirino, in office, April 17, 1948 to December 30, 1953, Elpidio Quirino y Rivera, a lawyer by profession. Quirino entered politics when he became a representative of Ilocos Sur from 1919 to 1925. He was then elected as senator from 1925 to 1931. In 1934, he became a member of the Philippine Independence Commission that was sent to Washington, D.C. 7th President of the Philippines, Ramon Magsaysay, in office, December 30, 1953 to March 17, 1957. Ramon Del Firo Magsaysay, Sr. was a Filipino statesman who served as the seventh president of the Philippines, from December 30, 1953 until his death in an aircraft disaster. An automobile mechanic by profession, Magsaysay was appointed military governor of Zambales after his outstanding service as a guerrilla leader during the Pacific War. Eighth president of the Philippines, Carlos P. Garcia, in office, March 18, 1957 to December 30, 1961, Carlos Polistico Garcia, was a Filipino teacher, poet, orator, lawyer, public official, political economist, guerrilla, and Commonwealth military leader who was the 8th President of the Philippines, 9th President of the Philippines, Diostado P. Macapagal Sr., in office, December 30, 1961 to December 30, 1965, Diostado Pangan Macapagal Sr. He also served as a member of the House of Representatives, and head of the Constitutional Convention of 1970. He was the father of Gloria Macapagal Arroyo, who followed his path as President of the Philippines from 2001 to 2010. 10th President of the Philippines, Ferdinand D. Marcos, in office, December 30, 1965 to February 25, 1986. Ferdinand Emmanuel Ederlin Marcos Sr. was a Filipino politician, lawyer, and kleptocrat, espousing an ideology of constitutional authoritarianism under the New Society Movement. He ruled as a dictator under martial law from 1972 until 1981, and kept most of his martial law powers until he was deposed in 1986. 11th President of the Philippines, Corazon C. Aquino, in office, February 25, 1986 to June 30, 1992, Maria Corazon Cohuanco Aquino.
popularly known as Cori Aquino, the first woman to hold that office. Corazon Aquino was the most prominent figure of the 1986 People Power Revolution, which ended the 20-year rule of President Ferdinand Marcos and led to the establishment of the current Democratic Fifth Philippine Republic. 12th President of the Philippines, Fidel V. Ramos, in office. June 30, 1992 to June 30, 1998, Fidel Valdez Ramos is a retired Filipino general and politician who served as the 12th President of the Philippines from 1992 to 1998. He is the only career military officer who reached the rank of five-star general slash admiral de jury who rose from second lieutenant up to commander-in-chief of the armed forces, 13th president of the Philippines, Joseph A. Hercido Estrada, in office. June 30, 1998 to January 20, 2001, Joseph A. Hercido Estrada is a Filipino politician and former actor who served as the 13th president of the Philippines from 1998 to 2001. 9th Vice President of the Philippines from 1992 to 1998, and the 26th Mayor of the City of Manila, the country's capital, from 2013 to 2019. In 2001, he became the first president in Asia to be impeached from an executive role and resigned from power. 14th President of the Philippines, Gloria Macapagal Arroyo, in office. January 20, 2001 to June 30, 2010. Maria Gloria Macareg Macapagal Arroyo. She served as the 10th Vice President of the Philippines from 1998 to 2001, and was a Senator from 1992 to 1998. After her presidency, she was elected as the representative of Pampanga's 2nd District in 2010 and later became the Speaker of the House of Representatives from 2018 until her retirement in 2019. She is the first woman to hold two of the highest offices in the country, Vice President and Speaker of the House, 15th President of the Philippines, Benigno Aquino III, in office. June 30, 2010 to June 30, 2016, Benigno Simianco Wanco Aquino III. Also known as Pinoy or Noynoy, is a Filipino politician who served as the 15th President of the Philippines from 2010 until 2016. Aquino is a fourth-generation politician and was the chairman of the Liberal Party from 2010 to 2016, 16th President of the Philippines, Rodrigo Duterte, incumbent, assumed office. June 30, 2016, Rodrigo Roa Duterte is a Filipino politician who is the current president of the Philippines and the first from Mindanao to hold the office. He is the chairperson of PDP Laban, the ruling political party in the Philippines. Duterte took office at age 71 on June 30, 2016, making him the oldest person to assume the Philippine presidency. Thanks for watching. Pixels Blog. Please subscribe.